So this video is brought to you by Migraine. That is my sponsor. Hi, I'm Lydia Broderick, and welcome to my channel. Well, good morning. Here we are. It is a beautiful day, a little chilly. I like that. A couple of fun facts about me. I never use the handle when I drink coffee. I apparently don't like it. Ah, delightful. So, the past two days, I have been experiencing a migraine attack. Um, I've gotten migraines for over 20 years now. However, I have this wonderful invention that my cousin got for me and it is an ice helmet. And thankfully it matches my hair. So I looked like this for the better part of two days. Um, and this was frozen and it helps to numb my skull. It doesn't get rid of the migraine, but it definitely, it's a good look, at least uh, coordinated. So, interesting thing, migraine is going to be the inspiration for what I'm going to do to this acrylic pour. I was originally going to do something else entirely with this pour um, before I got the migraine, but once I got the migraine, I was like, oh man, that's like how I feel like my eyeball feels right now. Like there's kind of an explosion going on in my brain and my, my eyeball is gonna just like explode out of my head with this tremendous pressure behind it. And then it's just gonna be like fire and blood pouring out of my skull. And it was really um, pleasant imagery that I was having. I'm not gonna paint that imagery of my skull bleeding fire because my eyeball popped out. It's a little too dark. Um, and I don't know that anybody would wanna hang that on their wall. <laughs> Least of all me, it's just a constant reminder of the debilitating pain you are feeling, Lydia. Your eyeball on the floor rolling around. <sighs> Nothing like a detached retina. Well, so, my idea though is that I am going to paint my right eye into this acrylic pour. We're gonna get into painting now. Painting a migraine, painting my eyeball, burning out of my head. <laughs> Yay! It's not creepy, it's really not. Okay, so the first thing that I'm gonna do to get my eye on here is sketch it out. I'm gonna sketch it out with a watercolor crayon because if I screw up in the sketch, all I have to do is take like a wet cloth and wipe it off. Um, wonderful invention, these carandash, if that's how you pronounce it. I'm not really sure, it's French. I don't speak French, so I'm just going with that. Carandash. Might not be right at all. So I'm gonna do that and then I'm gonna start laying down some acrylics. I already did my, um, color string for the for the monochromatic colors if you can see that so I mixed my red and my teal together and then made the darkest to lightest gray and I highly recommend that if you're playing with acrylic paints get a wet palette because then you don't lose your paint and it doesn't dry out that quickly a really good stopping point with the acrylics. I don't want to cover too much of the pour up. I'm going to be moving on to transparent oils and 
I can darken areas without making the pore completely disappear and I think that's where I want to go with this. I have gotten some of the lighter colors in with the acrylics and I can build on that with the oil paint but it's really hard to just go all opaque on this without having a base acrylic on some of the darker parts of the painting. So I'm going to let this dry and then I will continue on with oils. about living with chronic pain coming in the form of migraine or any kind of pain that you suffer from on a regular basis it makes it really easy to convey that artistically uh, this is flaming eyeball feeling like it's gonna pop out of your head surprisingly accurate anyway I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please hit the like button and subscribe if you haven't already subscribed. I would love to create a community where people can come here, hang out, watch videos, leave comments. I will see you next time and I love you guys. Stop breathing so loud, it sounds like an approaching tornado. Sorry. We should really clean the bathroom. Suck sh through a straw, we're not cleaning the bathroom today. <clears throat> it's a beautiful sunny day outside, it's, uh, it's too bad we're missing it. Eternal darkness would be preferable. Could you stop yelling? I'm not yelling. I'm not actually even talking. I'm just thinking. Oh, your thoughts are way too loud. We, have, we might feel better if we eat something. The kitchen is too far away. It's not. Bite me and choke on the gristle. Why do we have the Imperial March stuck in our head? I don't know. Because it feels like Lord Vader is using the force to melt our brain? Maybe we should try meditating. Please stop thinking.